Former President Donald Trump and Vice President Kamala Harris are focusing on the Keystone State with dual rallies scheduled in Pennsylvania this evening. Natalie Brand has more details from the White House. Three weeks from Election Day and the presidential candidates are crisscrossing the state that could decide it all. Former President Donald Trump is holding a town hall in Philadelphia while Vice President Kamala Harris rallies tonight in Erie on the other side of Pennsylvania. Ready to bring the funk? I'm trying. <laughs> Earlier Monday, she sat down for an interview with media host Roland Martin as the campaign steps up its outreach to black voters, particularly men. There is an intent to suggest to a lot of folks that their vote won't matter. I love black men. I love them. I love them. As Trump also courts support from black men, some Democratic Party leaders, including Congressman James Clyburn, worry about turnout. Black men, like everybody else, want to know exactly what I can expect. Uh, from the uh, Harris administration, and I've been very direct with them. The campaign unveiled new proposals Monday, including forgivable loans to black entrepreneurs, training and mentorship programs for high-demand industries, and legalizing recreational marijuana nationally. As new CBS News polling shows the race virtually tied in battleground states, former President Trump leaned into a signature issue, immigration. We need the agents. We, have to, we need them badly. And keeping our incredible veteran agents on the force. Don't leave us. Raise your right hand. You're not going to leave. You're not going to leave. Campaigning in Arizona Sunday, Trump received the endorsement of the Border Patrol Union and said he would work with Congress to hire 10,000 new Border Patrol agents and approve a raise. Natalie Brand, CBS News, the White House.